Welcome. Welcome to this uh, Reha certification personal training video. On this video, I'm going to show you, I'm going to share with you uh, what I have in mind. I'm going to start a new bash, a new certification training bash, where I'm going to start with a few students, like uh, let's say 10 students, maybe more, but minimum 10. And now you will see, uh, you will think, um, how can I join this certification personal training? Very easy. Let me show you with you a few slides before post or before show you this information. Uh, my name is uh, Fidel Valero. I'm Linux system administrator and I have a uh, three certification. So this is kind of a, everything that you need to know about me. There are more, but if I show you this, uh, if I start talking about this, we never ends. I start doing these uh, personal trainings and with a few students kind of uh, three years ago, but at some point I stopped it and I start doing the same with the people that speak Spanish with uh, excellent results. But now I'm back. I'm going to start again with the English market. So because I know the English people are very, very, very good on this and they need a good guy, a new, uh, a new training for the RHCSA exam. So if you want to know, I always share with a slide, where are you from? Where are you from? I always share this, um, but don't worry, you need to open this URL, nothing about that because this session is recorded and going to post on my channel soon. So, registration for the RH CSA training on RH EL8. If you go to this website, you will see kind of the, um, all the questions that you have in mind to before register or before start the training. I will open this uh, URL now. And this is what you are going to see on this on my blog. You will see registration for the RH CSA training RH EL8. This is the picture, blah. And this is kind of a brief introduction. Hello, as many of you know, I've been doing webinars, personal trainings, and courses also. My courses are on Udemy. But now I'm going to start a new batch of students on a live training. I don't want to record anything for a, another platform, right? So what, is, what are the questions that you, you probably in, uh, want to, to ask? What this means is kind of the first question. And a brief introduction about the training is kind of uh, easy, um, but the the questions on to these points are very very important now so how are we cover the objective so pretty much i always um group the objective let's say if we start talking about lvm it's better start to explain how to create a regular partition right if we cover how to create a partition now we are ready to start covering how to work with LVM, how to extend a logical volume, for example. Okay? Why my training? Well, many of you know that this, the cost of this training in general are around the world cost more than $1,000. And these students, these um, uh, students, yes, uh, don't have this kind of money to start this journey or to start this uh, this uh, this training. Um, that's why I start creating these courses, these trainings with a very very low cost, and the cost of this training or sessions 
it's gonna be just four dollars this four dollars is per session and now the question is how many sessions have your training okay my training only have for eight or ten sections so at the end you will pay only forty dollars this is kind of great maybe more let's say if I increase to 12 sections but no more than 12 and um, this is good because I just focus you will see okay Fidel, how many hours have one session no more than 90 minutes and you will see okay it's gonna be like a 90 or 100 hours but this is not enough for prepare for the RHCSA exam I know but I'm, I'm not going to to spend or waste your time on practical I mean practical no, and generic and theoretical um, concepts that you don't care I'm going to focus on the practice because practice is the key of the key to success, the key to pass, the key to ace the exam, okay? To get the best result on the exam. That's why uh, I the cost is very low and there are 10 sections only. The other thing that probably you are start thinking is how this work. Well, how this work, I'm referring to the sessions. I will create, um, I will start doing the sessions over the Zoom platform, which one is easy to install on Windows, Mac, and Linux. Okay? And easy to use, so every student can join, every, to every student can participate, and the limit of this is very high. So it's going to be like a 100 participants per session. I mean on the chat on the, on the platform and um, as you know I'm going to start with a minimum of 10 students no more than 20 so it's enough room for us um, the sessions will be recorded this is another question that you probably start asking because sometimes you need to or you can't attend to one session no worry you can also review this video and after I upload the video to a closed playlist this closed playlist is I mean if for um, just for you for just for the students no one can see this playlist support I will support him I will support you um, 24 7 and every time that you have questions I will be able to respond and uh, how this is going to work because I'm going to create a, a group on WhatsApp or Telegram in order to get all, all the students in the group so it's, this is easy to manage and to teach because sometimes one student has one question and probably another student has the same question so in this way I ju we just um, answer once and we can start a uh, I mean digging inside the same objective all the students together and we can learn more when we do and uh, when we cover this on this way um, first time meeting this first time meeting is gonna be to show you a little bit more about how the, the trainings goes um, but pretty much this is all that you need to know if you have any questions uh, I can share with you the link of this um, form this form is in order to to get your information and you will receive uh, like a message with the information about the about the group it's a, it's a closed group where you can join the platform. I mean, it's a closed group on Telegram 
where already we have eight students or seven or six, don't remember right now, but these students are ready to start. So as soon as you complete this form and you will get a message or you will see the 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 brief, the grievance, I mean a brief um, paragraph where I show or where I share this uh, link with you and you can join the the chat and on the chat we're going to start communicating and planning the best time for everyone to start the the training also i think i covered this on the, on the explanation somewhere um but i really don't remember now where i put this but we are going to focus first on the to create the bash and um, meet the requirements, I mean the minimum of 10 students. And then according to the time zone of each one, we can um, get like a, the easiest time and date for everyone, right? To start this training. So this is kind of a, everything that I want to share with you. This is a new bash for the Red Hat certification training RHCSA based on real eight. So if you have any question, I will very happy to respond to you. I will you can put a comment on the video and I will reply to you back as soon as I can. So thank you and see you on the training.